Hey guys, it's FIFA Rally here and welcome to another FIFA 15 player ratings video and in this video we are looking on the Bundesliga ratings. First up we got the keepers and by far Neuer is the best one. He got a plus 4 rating upgrade and yeah, those stats are just ridiculous and he will be a wall and impossible to get past. If he was not difficult enough to get past on FIFA 14, he will be even more difficult this year. But uh, moving on to the center backs, there's a lot of good ones. But the first one we've got to put in is Hummels. And next up, we are going to put in Boateng. And just one thing I quickly want to mention while we add in these players is that just as the Premier League player ratings video, this build is from just before transfer deadline day. So you might see a few players that haven't transferred away from the league and you might be missing a few players transferring into the league for example Kagawa but uh, yeah the free back I went with was Boateng, Hummels and the transfer Benasha and uh, that looks like a pretty solid free back in my opinion now moving on to the center mid options there's a lot of players you could go with Schweinsteiger, Gundogan I believe Thiago got full star skills and so does Boateng Four star skills on him, which is very nice in my opinion. He looks to be looks to be a pretty good player in my opinion. Now having those four star skills back as he had in FIFA 13, I believe it was. But the player we're gonna play here is not Lam, even though we got some really good stats for Senna Demsimid. We are going to play Luis Gustavo. He is He's a player who's always been good on that spot and uh, yeah, 74 pace, 83 defending, 82 physical, good work rates and quite tall. He's the ideal player to play there, especially when the other center mid, especially in this formation as well, is going to be quite attacking because there's a specific player I wanted to try out. Could have gone with Mkhitaryan, 86 pace, 5 star weak foot. He looks insane this year. De Bruyne is still having that 5 star weak foot and the 4 star skills. Firmino also with full star skills, but the one player I wanted to put into this side was Alexandru Max and 5 star skills, 4 star weak foot. And he looks to be a very fun player to give a go in Bundesliga squads on FIFA 15. So that is my midfield. Of course, in a 3-4-3 formation, I do not think Maxim is the ideal player on that kind of position. But I wanted to feature him in a squad. Now moving on to the left mid, we got a lot of cool options. Perisic, Draxler, Chupa Muting, Traore, Traore, Forster skills on him. But... We're going to play Ribery on the left mid spot. Now, moving on to the right mid. There's a lot of options as well. We've got Müller, Farfan, Blasikowski, Shakiri, Bamayang, and so on. Elia downgraded to four-star skills, unfortunately, so no more skill moves from him. But at least we got a maximum instead, which is quite nice. Now, I decided to put in Blasikowski because of his work rates. In this formation, I wanted to have at least one sort of defensive uh, right mid or left mid and I decided to go into him because he had those medium medium work rates now it in in on the right wing could have gone with Sam but there's only one player you want to play there from the Bundesliga and that is Iron Robin upgraded to a 90 rated player and his stats are just so so good on the game I guess him and Ribery basically swapped ratings this year now on the left wing, we could play Son with that 5-star weak foot and good pace on him. He He's always a fun player to use. We could play Pearson, but he's downgraded to 3-star skills, unfortunately. And instead, we will be playing another very good player on the left side of the pitch, and that is Royce. And that was basically the reason why I went with the 3-4-3 formation, to have Royce and Ribery into the same side. That will be a deadly attack down the left-hand side of the pitch. And the striker option, I think the two players you'll see the most in Bundesliga squads is probably Ramos or Lewandowski. And maybe you'll see Ben if somebody is crazy enough to play with him. But yeah, Ramos I think will be a very good player. And if you have a few more coins, Lewandowski is the one to go for in my opinion. He got some good all-run stats on him and I think he, he will be pretty solid. So this is pretty much the squad we went with. I think if you want to make it a little bit more ideal, you'll probably play Schweinsteiger and Lahm on the center mid spots. But I just wanted to have a few more clubs into my Bundesliga squad in some way. So I went with a Maxim and Gustavo instead. Now moving on to the substitutes and reserves, highest rated players, you just almost only have Bayern Munich players. And it kind of makes sense because a lot of them played really well in the World Cup and most of them actually won it. So yeah, they are kind of dominating the highest uh, ratings in the league. We got Martinez and uh, you got... Um, 
you got Alonso in as well, and then uh, you got a few Schalke players and Dortmund players in, uh, in the end. Gundogan there, you got Hundela, Farf and Weidenfeller, and finally we got a Dande there into the squad. So that is all for the Bundesliga player ratings. I hope you enjoyed the video, and we'll be back again with another FIFA 15 video soon again. And that is pretty much all. Thank you for watching, and I'll talk to you later.